Welcome back to my shed. I hope you uh, had a good Christmas and a good New Year. Uh, I managed to get hold of myself some of this unicorn spit. So I thought I'd do a quick video and see what it's like. I'm going to uh, just use one colour for now just to see what the outcome's like. I've had a, I've had a look outside. I found this uh, old beam came off a pallet from when I was building the shed. I'm going to quickly uh, cut it down, drill a couple of holes in it, torch it and hopefully stain it and make a nice little tea light holder. Uh, let's get started. <laughs> now back in the shed it's been uh, been about 24 hours since I did this and uh, color looks great it's gone a bit chalky but um, I think with a bit of wire wool it would uh, would remove that bring out the blacks and then hopefully good for uh, a coat of spray lacquer problem is I've run out of wire wool so I'm thinking of just using one of these hoping it gives the same sort of effect but uh, we'll just we'll see what happens. It has now had two coats of spray lacquer and I, I, I do like the outcome. I do think it's a bit too chalky for what I was going for, but I think that's due to the ratio I used for unicorn spit to water. I did try adding water to the leftover what was in the pot just to see what the differences was, and I did get a better outcome on a piece of scrap. So I will be re-attempting this on another piece on another piece of wood with um, with more water this time than unicorn spit. So hopefully it comes out with a more of a more of a uh, stain than a paint, I would say, because of the chalkiness. Rubbing over it first did help it a lot by bringing out the uh, black in the grain. So uh, that's definitely a good tip to use when trying to do this. Uh, I will be trying this again on a future project. So that this is what this video is all about: was really just trying out unicorn spit and hoping that the outcome is what I was hoping for. So there's a little bit more working, a little bit more testing I need to do before I even think about putting it on the main project, which will be done sometime this year. But I, but yeah, at some point. So um, if you like what you're seeing and you want to give me a and you want to subscribe, that would be great. If you could leave, leave me a comment down below, that'd be great. I do think the outcome of this is better than the jack o' lantern. I did early in the year, so the video link will be up there if you haven't seen that yet. And 
thanks for watching. I will uh, see you on the next video.